Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing an unboxing video. As you can see, I have here three boxes to unbox. So let's get started. So I am going to start with this box because my husband asked me earlier if I can start unboxing this one. Because my husband said it is very important for me to open this for first. versus the box. Okay. Oh wow. <laughs> so this is actually a plant. Let me take it out from the box. It is packed immaculately, <laughs> which is good actually. Very secured. Two leaves have fallen, but that's fine. So this is a Carolina Ripper. Carolina, Carolina. I don't know if I'm saying it correctly. Anyways, this is considered as the hottest chili pepper in the whole world, according to Guinness World Record as of August 2017. So I am actually looking forward for this to bear some fruit, some chilies, because my husband is challenging me with this. Because every time I would taste a chili, I would just say, nah, it's not that really hot. <laughs> so he was like, okay, wait, let me buy something for you. <laughs> so yeah, I really just can't wait for this to bear some chilies so I can finally taste it and confirm if it is really the world's hottest chili pepper. So yeah, it's actually packed really nice. Now I understand why my husband told me to open this for first. Oh, good thing I have here a planter which is gray. Look at the roots. Let's see if this will fit. Yes, it's not that bad actually. And ta-da! My Carolina Ripper is now looking good <laughs> i don't like this one this is gray and this one is red that's fine so next so this one is oh <laughs> he is not done yet with the plant so look at this one Carolina Ripper spicy powder, spicy oil, and oh, I got it. These are three different stuff. Oh my goodness. My brain is not functioning. Okay, so, so this is a trace of Carolina Ripper, meaning these are three different stuff. So it comes with um, peperoncino polvere, meaning spicy powder. Um, spicy oil and a spicy cream. So this is the Guinness World Record Pupicante Almondo Kit or Guinness World Records Hottest in the World Kit. So yeah, I'm so excited to see what's inside it. So let's try these out. Oh my goodness. So this is the crema or cream. And this one here is the powder. And this is, of course, the oil. Olio picante. So we have here the olio picante or spicy oil. Look at that. Wow, I can't wait to try these out. So it says in here, Picantissimi Olio Peperoncino Carolina Ripper. So meaning, um, very spicy oil and pepper. Carolina Ripper. So we have here the ingredients, of course, and also the expiration date. So this is 30 ml. 
So next we have, so this one here is the Crema de Peperoncino Picante Stremo. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so it means cream of spicy pepper. Stremo means extreme. Oh my goodness. My husband was actually serious when he told me that he is going to buy something really spicy for me. So this is 30 grams and it has the expiration date also and also the ingredients in here as well as the guarantee seal. Natural product without preservatives after opening if refrigerated. Okay. And then lastly, we have this powder. This is Peperoncino Picante Stremo or um, Spicy Pepper Extreme. Polvere di Peperoncino or um, Pepper Powder. It also has here the ingredients, the expiration date, and this is only 10 grams. I am so excited to try all of this. As soon as I cook some pasta or even make pizza, I am going to use all of this. Okay, next. We have here the third box. And the last one. Oh wow. Oh, I know what it is. So these are some elastics for my Sophia's trampoline because it is quite damaged now. So my husband's gonna change all the elastics for it to function again. So yeah. And then next, this one. Oh my goodness, I had been wanting to have one like this. So look at that. So this one here is Vaporiera or when you want to cook something when you want a steamer a steamer i guess if i'm not mistaken so va vaporiera is a steamer look at that so this is in bamboo let me open it so we have here the description of this Vaporiera. So it says in here Vaporiera bamboo, the 24 centimeter or 24 centimeters steamer bamboo. I actually had been wanting to make some ravioli. Oh, um, some dumplings. I actually have a steamer at home, but it's so small. Every time I would make puto, I always have to do it um, in two batches, especially if it's many, because I have a very small steamer at home. And I had been wanting a bamboo steamer particularly. So I am so excited for this. It has one, two, two layers. As you can see, it is so nice. I am going to be making a video when I make a dumpling for the first time because I haven't made any in my whole life. Pa. So, yeah. So, this is from Milano or Milan. I am so excited. So, it looks like that at the bottom. It has two layers. And, oh my goodness. I like this detail in here. It's like a banig. <laughs> it's like a banig in my province. Remembering banig made me miss home and my childhood.
So I am about to try the crema di peperoncino. So for safety reason, <laughs> yes, I am gonna put just a little bit of this in here. And let's see if this is a really, really mm. spicy. So it looks like this. I am gonna try just a little bit of this. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It is spicy. Mamma mia. Mamma mia. Picante. Oh my goodness. <laughs> It is super spicy. Oh my goodness. And then let's try. Mmm. Oh good. So you have to put just a little bit of this because it's really really spicy. Papa, what's that thing? Bravissima Joya mia. And so yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, for today's unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And if you did, can you give this a thumbs up? And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Only if you want to, obviously. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this video and my other videos. See you in my next one. Bye.